are the opposition CPIM and Congress all set to stitch an alliance for the 2023 assembly polls in the state? Well, in a first in recent times, top leaders of the CPIM and the Congress in the state shared the same platform calling for a united fight against the ruling BJP. Senior Congress leader Sudeep Roy Burman, former MLA Ashish Kumar Saha, CPIM State Secretary and former MP Jitendra Chaudhary and other left leaders shared the dais during a program in Agartala today. So now let's listen into what the CPIM and Congress leaders had to say about the meet. This meeting, though it is a small, but it is a significant that whether all these flows, all this that is called the section of the people, the secular and democratic people could be united and it is possible. Then today onslaught upon the democracy, onslaught upon the constitution, how Modi and its bigot doing, from that it can be freed off. So it is small, it is, uh, it is late, but of course and very important the event. If political atmosphere can be built either from left, right in, or independent, all democratic people are that is elected. So automatically, the fascistic, the nature of the government, it will go. So that's why what we, we do emphasize that all democratic people, secular people, either national or regional, they should come forward and this fascistic force should be defeated. You can say that a fascist government is going on in Tripura. There is no democracy in their government. कोई आम जनता का लिबार्टी चुरमार हो गया यहाँ पे कोई डेवलपमेंट सही ढंग से नहीं हो रहा है करप्शन बहुत ऊंचा है तो ये सब को लेके सारे डेमोक्रेटिक पार्टी में एक नारा सबके तरफ से आया है कि एक जोट हो, हो के लड़ना पड़ेगा तो ये हमारा जो इंडियन नेशनल कांग्रेस हमारी भी ये सोच है तो सबको एक जगह में आके ऐसा अनडेमोक्रेटिक फैसिस्ट गवर्नमेंट को उसको यहाँ से हटाना है उसके खिलाफ लड़ना है और जनता जो सोचता है जनता की सोच को सम्मान करना चाहिए all right, to know more, we are being joined live with our assistant news editor, Pinaki Das from Agartala. Uh, so, Pinaki's strong indication of a pre-poll alliance between CPIM and Congress. So, what are your sources telling you regarding this, Pinaki? See, uh, since Sudeep Rai Berman, who was in BJP, had left BJP and joined Congress, he gave an announcement that all are welcome and all will come together to form an alliance or rather give a tough fight to the BJP. Now uh, after Sudhir Prai Burman, he after winning the by-election, he also announced that he'll call all the opposition parties except BJP to a talk over a cup of tea on the strategies. And today uh, we were we found that Sudhir Prai Burman was sharing the same dais with Jitendra Chaudhary who is the CPIM state state, uh, state uh, uh, party secretary. So this is an indication to us what the coming days the Tripura's politics or the dynamics is moving toward. Though none of them have officially announced about any alliance but this is this is a fact that very carefully they are moving toward and to, to trying to get the pulse of the people what they uh, want. What uh, because they have to very careful about that on the contrary BGP does not encase this against them that uh, the, 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 the that CPM and Congress had been always together on days to say that uh, Delhi mein dosti or Tripura mein kusti. That means uh, in Delhi you have a friendship and here you are fighting to show the people. So so they are very careful about that and and probably this is the first time that they are sharing the same dais ones who were uh, open uh, against each other. Now they are saying a bigger enemy is. BJP, so, uh, they are not secular, they are running a fascist government, so we have to come united and, and bring, uh, in fact, respect the people's 
mood that they want to give a tough fight to the BJP against the fascist activities as they have been alleging. And uh, Pinaki, is it, uh, it is certain now that uh, the BJP will have to be fight a united opposition, isn't it? Exactly. BJP was to some extent prepared for this also because uh, BJP, if you see, they have been already campaigning against this, that uh, CPM and Congress may again uh, conspire to uh, uh, against the BJP. They have used categorically the word conspired because earlier also uh, uh, when Congress was getting the vote share of more than 40 percent but could not come to power, uh, the, the main allegation even the Congress leaders like Sudhir Prabh Burman and his camp who had joined BJP, they used to say that Delhi did not allow them uh, uh, to fight, give a tough fight to the CPM and that was, that is why they could not uh, remove the CPIM. Now they have come together and BJP is using the same word uh, against them so that they, the, the people, so that the people know uh, that the anti-BJP uh, vote does not get united, particularly the old uh, Congress leader and the communist leader who have been uh, rival, uh, they don't come together and, and BJP can uncash on that. That is what BJP is trying, though BJP has to worry about it because if you add the vote share, uh, that gives a tough fight uh, to the, uh, if you know, keeping in concern the previous election uh, total vote share, if you, that gives a tough fight to the BJP because the uh, vote share was very less even less than 1% between the opposition CPIM and the ruling BJP. Uh, though, uh, though a new party has for, come, uh, that is Tipra Mota, which is considered a, uh, considered a, uh, the king maker at this time, but stats, things are changing because right now when I am standing, I came to know that the former Congress uh, president of the uh, Tripura, that is uh, Pijus Vistas, has only some time back joined Trinamul. So things are changing in Tripura, the dynamics of the opposition is changing. We have to wait and see for some time what, in which way it moves. Alright, Pinaki Das, thank you so much for all those details.